Hey YouTube, today I'm gonna show you how to jumpstart your dead car and this is the dead one, my 2004 Mitsubishi Lancer ES manual and this one's dead. The first thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need a car that is running and here's my other vehicle, 2003 Pontiac grand am and this one has good charge for its battery so we're gonna boost the mitsubishi lancer and the second thing you're gonna need is a booster cable here and i will unbox this and show you guys how to set this up so the next step is opening the hood on both the vehicles the lever for this one's right there. So after you do that, you want to hook up the cables and I will show you guys after I do that. So you guys set up the red with the black. How you know it's red is it's got red right beside that part there. It's red and this part is mainly black. That's how you know. And on this side, you'll know it's red because that's red right there and that's black so what you do next is you start the vehicle with the running battery so what we're gonna do is we are going to start this vehicle here grab the keys and we'll start her up Here we go, start it up. Wait a couple seconds. Wait a couple seconds until you start up this other vehicle. About five minutes. And I'll let you guys know when I start this vehicle. So it's been running about two to three more minutes now so I'm gonna get into this other car it should be relatively charged and start the vehicle all right here we go okay guys she started smooth. Let's check out how our belts are doing. Yeah, our belt looks good, guys. That's what it looks like. We're going to leave it running for a couple minutes so that it gets its full charge and keep an eye on the belts we just did guys there's the alternator belt we'll let it run for 10 minutes And you guys would know if it, it's too loose. If it's not turning, then it's too loose. And if it turns too slow, if it turns too slow, like you can kind of uh, read the letters on it, then that means it's too tight. Or another way you know that it's too loose, if it's wiggling, if it doesn't look tight, if it's like wiggling. But yeah guys, she's running perfectly and it's already been a couple minutes. There's the alternator. Well, she's running perfectly guys. 
And here's the serpentine belt. Yeah, she's running perfectly. So after she's been charged, you want to turn off the vehicle that's running so let's do that guys oops I forgot my keys so let's turn off the vehicle turn off this vehicle as well and then we will turn off the other vehicle here To make sure you don't mess with the electricals because I know you can mess with all the vehicles electrical wiring and stuff if you just take off the booster cables while the one of them is running or even both of them is running so this is the safest way both of them are off both of them are off right and now we can take off the booster cables starting with the car you charge so this one starting with the black you always want to start with the black and then red uh, black and then red all right guys that's how you boost your car's battery on a 2004 Mitsubishi Lancer with a 2000 feet Pontiac Grand Am and i'll put the boosters away and i hope you guys have a great day make sure you give me a like share and subscribe turn on that notification and peace